coming to this theater soon, The Beast of Yucca Flats. Filmed on the burning hot sands by Yucca Flats. See terror, panic, murder. See the Cardoza and Francis production of The Beast of Yucca Flats. See a man turn killer. See a woman ravaged. See one of the most exciting movies ever made. See The Beast of Yucca Flats. Killer on the loose. Death sweeps across the desert. Panic. A bloodthirsty killer stalks a moonlit desert. See the beast of Yucca Flats. Hello, folks. Welcome to day four of the 31 Days of Howling Beasts. I am your host this time around, Gary Hill. And uh, with me today is the film. (laughs) Uh, A lot of folks talk about this film. I'm doing the Beast of Yucca Flats, which is a film that that came out in um, 1961. Uh, This film is a a constant joke uh, amongst the... the, um, the riffing community, including a notorious episode of the Mystery Science Theater 3000. Uh, great artwork on that box, by the way. I love that artwork. Uh, it stars uh, former Swedish wrestler Tor Johnson and favorite of um, of Mr. Ed Wood. Uh, put him in, in movies as well. and He's always, always playing this brute, and, and this film is no exception. Uh, your basic plot of the film is... <clears throat> A uh, Soviet scientist named uh, Joseph Jaworski, who's Tor Johnson, d- who defects, it says a lot here, and flees to the Nevada test site called Yucca Flats, only to be churned into a mindless monster by atomic radiation. Stalking the desert, the film has very little dialogue and most of the speech is done by an omniscient narration. And that is most of the dialogue. The most of the dialogue of the film is uh, done by this guy... Like, it's almost like a nature documentary, if you will. Him telling, like, the story of, of this man who y- you're meant to feel sympathy for, kind of, but he's really a bad man. Because <laughs> um, once he uh, runs out into the desert, he is irradiated by, by, um, by, by a bomb. It's a bomb testing site. A real life bomb testing site, I, 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 I'll say, because uh, the real Yucca Flats um, was one of the most irradiated nuclear blasted spots on the face of the earth. <clears throat> 1979 years that the film was made, 86 workers were exposed to radiation during the Yucca Flats Bainberry test. Uh, in March 2009, Time identified the accident as one of the world's most World's worst nuclear dis- nuclear disasters. Um, it was actually shot in uh, in, in California, uh, Santa Clarita for the desert's uh, scenes, and then the the airport, and then Van Nuys in the opening scene interior, <coughs> which is one of the big <coughs> sorry big complaints about the film because uh, it starts with the strangulation of this nude woman. You know, which is in some versions, is not in some versions, because the director apparently liked nude scenes. You know, this is 1961. You know, the rise of the nudie cuties were, were uh, about, and he wanted to have boobs in his film, so he had this scene that people complain about because it makes no sense, because it's clearly Tor Johnson's irradiated arms that you see in the movie, but it, they show it at the beginning of the movie. Um, anyway, we'll get into it now. Uh, Tor Johnson, uh, our, our, our hero slash, you know, villain, uh, cause he, he strangles two women in this film. Why well, he, he, uh, young, young lovers are pulled over to the side of the road and they, um, of course the, the boyfriend goes to go leave to go check on something and the girl is crept on in the back. I don't know. I got in the back of her car, but he's in the back of her car and chokes her and kills her too. So... Yeah, 
radiation has made our man, uh, our, our good doctor here, uh, go crazy. <laughs> and um, there, there's a, there's a involvement of the a sharpshooters and a helicopter involved of them flying through the desert trying to try to kill him, you know, with their rifle, and he doesn't seem to go down. Uh, t two young boys who are actually the director's sons get lost in the desert and they're being pursued by by our uh, our, our bad guy here the good doctor and y yeah it's, it's it's I'll say this about this film it's 54 minutes long it's it's not a bad time for your 54 minutes as they make it out to be in the in the in the you know critics reviews and everything else and blah 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 and it's not it's not as bad as people say I think I, I think it, it moves at a pretty steady pace <clears throat> it's a good one time watch if, if you want to watch something to say hey uh, I'm, I'm going to watch the Beastie Uncle Flats without the riff tracks it's not a bad 54 minutes to spend um, you can get this a lot of places you get this on YouTube Many Mill Creek and Echo Bridge, you know, uh, compilation discs, um, Platinum released a DVD, uh, Image Entertainment, which I'd like to have, uh, released a disc in 2000, the year 2000, because they usually put extras on the disc. Um, they also released it as a double with Mesa of Lost Women from 1953, that sounds kind of wild. Um... Yeah, not a whole lot more to say about this film. The the ending I kind of like because it was kind of an accident. Our our our, ki our killer, our, our doctor, is is shot down, laying there. While laying there, uh, a jackrabbit runs up beside him, and he he kind of pets him kind of kindly, like he's kind of changed his way, or he kind of fall in love with this this little jackrabbit. But this is an accident <coughs> that they happen to catch on film, and. I think it's a nice one. I think it's a nice one to say, you know, hey, our man's still alive. So then maybe, you know, the opening scene makes a little bit of sense to say, hey, he's still alive and he's still out terrorizing women in in, in, uh, in Van Nuys somewhere. And that's not a nice thing to say, but I, I love to think that Tor Johnson lives forever uh, in our hearts and strangling women. Uh, he is truly... The, the the beast of uh, Yucca Flats uh, released to television as Atomic Monster, the Beast of Yucca Flats. Because, but the thing about it is that 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 site, I mean that 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 name really doesn't really uh, mean a whole lot because he really was a beast already. He was a bad person, apparently uh, carrying secrets and and running away with them from from the 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 G Men. Uh, that that were ch the KGP G KGB KGP KGB G men that were chasing him, and uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, our director Coleman Francis um was an actor, writer, producer, and director apparently, and is best known for his trilogy, uh, consisting of the BCO Flats, the Skydivers and Red Zone Cuba. So I imagine a lot of these had to deal with nuclear stuff and bombs and you know, not so subtle uh <laughs> not so subtle, you know, saying, Hey, you know, bombs are bad, nuclear power is bad. Was it trend for this time? Was it trend for a while? Russia bad, you know, Tor Johnson bad. But you know what? I, I like me some Tor Johnson, and I, I'm going to leave it at that. And if you haven't watched it without the Rift Tracks, I'd say watch it without the Rift Tracks once for yourself. And um, see what you think. I'm not saying it's the best thing you're going to watch all day. But uh, it is the BC Yucca Flats. And on day five of the 31 Days of Howling Beasts, we have a very special guest. Uh, we have many, many special guests for this month, and I'm excited to hear all your stuff. I have many submissions so far. Uh, well, this one's from our friend Ricky Morgan from the Hail Ming Power Hour and many other things that you may have heard him from. And he is doing a film from 1985, I believe, called Attack of the Beast Creatures. And I, I've listened to this uh, already, and 
It is, uh, I'm sure it's much more phenomenal than the movie itself, but I've seen those beast creatures uh, in pictures, and they look Asian and kind of racist, but you know what? They're kind of adorable, and they have little beast creature butts, and uh, I'm sure Ricky will tell us all about that in his review.